Bouncy, 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 hey, bouncy, JJ, bouncy. is that the best JJ idea to, to be jumping on the bouncy, bed like that? Bouncy, bouncy, Beds bouncy, are for bouncy, sleeping, bouncy. not jumping. Bouncy, bouncy, jumping and you bouncy, should really bouncy. be <laughs> careful. Are you okay, JJ? That really hurt. <laughs> JJ, have a boo-boo. Where does it hurt? <laughs> my head and my arm and everywhere. Uh-oh, you took a serious spill there. I hate to say I told you so. Everything hurts. Okay, okay, I'll call the ambulance and we can get you checked out. Hurry! <laughs> Here it comes! Okay, JJ, you're gonna be fine. I'm gonna take good care of you. Let's get you into the ambulance. Now I'm gonna check your vitals. Those are good, so you know it's nothing too serious. I have this boo-boo checkup kit. Let's grab the clipboard out. I'm gonna go through this entire checklist to make sure we don't miss anything. First, let's mask up. Now use a stethoscope to listen to your heart. That sounds great. Can you turn around for me so I can listen to your lungs? Thanks. Your breathing is perfectly normal. Now take your temperature with this thermometer. That's 98.6, which is perfectly normal. Now use this otoscope to look inside of your ears, and I'll shine the light at the end to look at your pupils. This is basically a mini magnifying glass with a light. Everything looks normal there. Now can you say ah for me? Ah! Uh... Very good. Now use this knee hammer to check your reflexes. That one's good. And so is this one. Everything there checks out fine. Why don't we take an x-ray to see if you broke anything? Stay very still for me. All done, let's check out the picture. Hmm, I see, I see. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, JJ, it looks like you have a small fracture in your arm. That's basically a little crack. Does it hurt when I do this? Yeah, it hurts a lot. Okay, no worries. I'm gonna put a cast on it so it heals properly. This will make it heal faster too, so you can get back to playing but not jumping on the bed. As for the pain, I'll give you a little shot for it. You'll feel better in no time. Anything to make the pain not hurt anymore. Don't worry, this will work really fast. There, all done. And now I see a few scratches on your face from the fall. I'll put some ointment on and then a Band-Aid. This will make sure you don't have a scar and the Band-Aid will keep it clean. Which Band-Aid would you like? Um, 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 the green one, please. Good choice. And how about for the little scratch? Blue, please. There, all better. You'll have to stay here a bit so I can observe you to make sure you're doing okay. Oh, but I wanna go and play. I'm bored. I thought you might be bored, so I have this Ryan's World Imagine Ink for you to do. Yay, I love Ryan. Me too. So this Imagine Ink booklet has a bunch of activities inside that will challenge us in reading, writing, counting, and problem solving. We're gonna use one magic marker to reveal rainbow colors and complete the challenges. While I pop out the marker, if you're new to this channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss any awesome videos. This one says, color the picture. Can you find which square completes the picture? Let's color in all four squares first. We're looking for the top left piece. Is it A? No, that's the top right. Let's try B. Yeah, that looks like it. And now C. No, 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 not that one. Yeah, so the answer's B, right? Let's check it. You're right, JJ, great job. This next one says, search the puzzle below for these six words. Alpha, Lexa, Combo, Panda, Gus, and Peck. I'll find them and you spell it, JJ. I found Alpha. A L P. H A. There's Lexa. L E X A. I see combo. C O M B O. There's Panda. P A N D A. I spy Gus. G 
G U S. And there's Peck. P E C K. That was an amazing job spelling. Let's do some more. This activity says color in the dotted rectangle, then draw lines to connect the characters that match. Let's color in the rectangle first. Now, which does number one go with? One goes with B. How about number two? Number two is Peck, and that's C. And number three? Three is Ryan, and he is at the top. A. Very good, JJ. Let's check your answers below. You got them all right. This next page says, "Can you find the pizza path? The pizza slices will guide you." Got it. We need to keep following the way the pizza is pointing. You made it! Yay! We made it to the finish line. That one was fun. Let's do the next page. This says, "Color the dotted rectangle, then count each of the toys in Ryan's room." All right, JJ. Just give me a few minutes to color in this entire thing. Then you can count. So let's count the skateboards first. Go ahead. One, two, three, four. Four skateboards. Good job. How about the footballs? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, there's seven. And now for the soccer balls. One, two, three, four, five. You're right. There's five of them. Fantastic counting. Let's do one more. This says Ryan is mixing colors with his paints. Color the splats to see the color names. So we're gonna color in the primary colors and mix them together to make secondary colors. Let's do it. This says red plus yellow equals orange. This one is blue plus red equals purple. And this one is yellow plus blue equals green. Yay! Now we know how to mix colors together to make new colors. That was awesome, and this booklet was so much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hit that like button if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to see more. Thanks.